If you love noodles and curry, you'll love Singapore noodles. They're one of the most popular Chinese takeout dishes out there, and for good reason. Along with wonton soup, sweet and sour chicken, sesame noodles, and fried rice, they are one of my go-to choices, especially when I'm in the mood for a warm and flavorful fried noodle dish. When done well, Singapore noodles are amazing. The right mix of soft and chewy rice noodles tossed with crisp vegetables, juicy meats, and just the right amount of seasoning. What are Singapore noodles? Singapore noodles, sometimes called Singapore style noodles or Singapore fried noodles, are a stir fried rice vermicelli noodle dish flavored with curry powder. In Chinese, they're called Sing Chow Mei Fun which translates to Star Continent Fried Vermicelli Rice Noodles, aka Singapore Noodles. The noodles usually come with vegetables, scrambled eggs, and a protein. Most commonly chicken, pork, shrimp, or a combination of all three. Contrary to the name, Singapore Noodles are not from Singapore, but Hong Kong. How to make Singapore noodles Prep the noodles Soak the noodles in a large bowl of cold tap water until pliable and slightly soft. Drain well. Prep the vegetables and proteins, slice the onion, julienne the carrot and bell pepper, and cut the green onions into 1 to 2 inch lengths. Cut the meats into slices slash bite sizes and peel and clean the shrimp. Prep the seasoning, in a bowl. Mix together chicken stock, oyster sauce, curry powder, toasted sesame oil, salt, and sugar. Set aside. Cook the eggs, lightly beat the eggs, season with salt, then scramble in a large pan or wok until mostly set. Scoop the eggs out and set aside. Cook the proteins, if your pan needs it, give a bit of a wipe then stir fry the proteins, moving and tossing, until they're cooked. Cook the vegetables, add the vegetables to the wok slash pan and cook, stirring, and tossing, until the vegetables are crisp. This step won't take long at all. Mix and toss, add the noodles, the sauce you made earlier, and the eggs. Use the scooping lifting motion to toss and combine everything together until the noodles are hot and the ingredients are well distributed and seasoned. Taste and adjust if needed. Enjoy! Eat up while fresh and hot. Why this recipe when done well, Singapore noodles are amazing, but they're often not done well. Because they are a sauce-less fried noodle they can be prone to drying out, especially if you're having them from a restaurant that isn't a Singapore noodle specialist. My answer to combating dry Singapore noodles is more sauce. I grew up eating Singapore noodles and my favorite iteration is not particularly traditional but is extremely delicious. Whenever I can, I love topping Singapore noodles with a flavorful curry chicken gravy. The savory, rich curry gravy makes the noodles extra saucy and addictive. Of course, extra curry gravy on top is not traditional so you can skip this extra step if you want, but trust me when I say that it definitely ups the flavors and enjoyability of Singapore noodles. Are Singapore noodles from Singapore? No, nope, they aren't. Singapore noodles come from Hong Kong via casual Hong Kong style cafes. The origins of the name is somewhat murky, but most people agree that Singapore noodles contain an eclectic mashup of distinct cultures and cuisine Singapore is known for, Chinese, Malaysian, and India. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe.